Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Michael Gillahan with Spring Mill. We just wanted to come back to you. Uh, I know in our last video that we went live, uh, we lost connection and uh, our camera wasn't very well. We bought a new camera and we just want to give you a better tour and uh, show you everything that we offer. And I wanted to tell you a little bit about the mill. It, it is an old grist mill. It was built in 1867 by Lieutenant John Adams Snobble. He had built some bridges in the area, but they are no longer here from flooding and other things. He had also built the Jackson County Courthouse that is now a, a state park museum. And uh, I would just like to show you around the house and show you our deck. Welcome to the Spring Mill House. This is our big party room. It holds up to 150 plus. Uh, as you can see, we got two TVs. They are mirrored together. You can, uh, if you got a family and you want to play a video of your family, we have where you can hook that up. Uh, we've got a fireplace. This is our kitchen area. Uh, we have glassware, silverware. Uh, we have pots and pans where you can cook a full meal here, or you can have your choice of a cater. Uh, we have this out here. This is the seating area. And also we've got it set up where the cater can back right in and set up your food. This is one of our bedrooms. We've got two queens. Uh, we have this set up. This room here is actually set up for the bride to get ready. Uh, we'll have a chair here and uh, plenty of light and mirrors for the bride to get ready. Uh, this is the bathroom and the old part that we completely redone. I know in that last video, uh, the camera footage wasn't very good, the color, but I just wanted, wanted you to see all this barn wood and the, the metal up here, the design in it. This is our master. This is for the groom and bride. Uh, we got a king size bed here. Uh, we're coming back into the old part. Uh, we have this couch here. It makes it into a queen size bed. Uh, we got TV, satellite, uh, gaming for the kids. This is another bathroom that we've redone. This is in the old part and just wanted to show it to you.
This is like one of our kids' bedroom. This is the new part that we added on. It's a big living room. Uh, you got TV, fireplace. This is one of our bedrooms in the new part. We have a queen size bed here. This is one of our king size beds in the new part of the house. We have joining bathrooms. We have another queen size bed in here. This is our balcony. Uh, I think it'd be a great place to have like a reception dinner or just a regular dinner. Uh, the last wedding we had, there was probably over a hundred people up here and they got, they got their picture taken. Uh, it was a great picture. This is uh, part of the old house. This is the living room in here. Uh, we completely restored all of this. Uh, we brought in the, the rustic tin. Uh, we made all the lighting in here. Uh, we made the, the fireplace mantle. Uh, we wanted to do that with the mirror for the bride getting pictures taken. Uh, the tables, the end tables, we, we made it all right here at Spring Mill. We, uh, we built all this here. Uh, this is all barn wood with uh, epoxy on it. Uh, the top there, when we re redone the mill, uh, it was in the basement. It was actually on spring mill in the 70s and we wanted to refurbish it. We brought it over. We, we built all the cabinets. It has the metal in it. Uh, I wanna show you the sink here. We built it. It is uh, it's solid wood, barn wood. Uh, the bottom is concrete with epoxy and we, we put 2020 in it. This is our deck that we built. Uh, we've got it set up where on both sides we can set up chairs. Uh, and we've got the walkway for the bride. We've got where we can stack chairs up through here and on both sides. Uh, we can hold at least 100, 150 people plus right here on this deck. Let her show you around. Right out, right out here in this field, uh, we have valet parking. Uh, if you have a wedding here, uh, we've got this whole field for parking. I just want to come back to you and let you know what we have going. Uh, in November, the week of Thanksgiving, we have days available if you'd like to book your Thanksgiving. Uh, also in December, uh, if you'd like to we're at the Spring Mill House to have your business Christmas party. We have days available in December. Uh, also, Shelly Henry, who 
in the Batesville Chamber of Commerce is helping me. We're trying to uh, set the date for December 18th. Uh, I'll let everybody know if something changes. Uh, we, we just don't know because of the COVID. If something changes, we'll let you know. But it, if everything works out, it will be our grand opening. I want to invite everybody out. We'll have Santa Claus here. Uh, the time on that will be like four to eight o'clock. And uh, we will have our photographer here. If, you, if your family would like to take a picture with Santa Claus, or if you would rather take a picture with the meal, we'll have that available as well. And also, uh, I talked in the last video that we we're trying to hit 20,000 likes and follows on our Spring Mill page. Uh, we're up past the 5,000 mark, so we're, we're making it uh, every day. It's growing. Uh, also, next week, we'll have uh, shirts and hoodies available. We will have another video to show, and plus, next week, they will be on our website on our Spring Mill Facebook page. You can place your order. And also, at the grand opening, we will have shirts and hoodies. Uh, you can buy them there as well. And also, I just want to talk about, uh, I mentioned in my last video about all the guys out there in the car community. I would like to start a yearly annual car show, classic car show here at Spring Mill. Uh, if there's anybody out there, uh, please comment, reach out to me. I would love your input. Also, we have started a YouTube channel. Please check us out on YouTube. Uh, please subscribe and like our videos. We, we want to make that grow. Uh, we will be having videos of what across the road of what we have planned over there and it's pretty exciting what we're going to be doing across the road. I just wanted to come back to you. Uh, thank you for all your support. Have a good day.